there is one practice that will benefit your business, your authentic business, and your creativity more than just about anything else, which is the discipline of consistent content creation. Whether you choose to do videos or whether you choose to write, I encourage you to make it a discipline. Don't just always be thinking, oh, if I make videos, then I should get more clients. I have my, if I write, then maybe I'll get more visitors to my website. Okay? I'm trying to get my phone to, <laughs> to stay put. I might have to hold it. Do it because the discipline is beneficial as its own, for its own sake. Okay? The discipline will translate into many other benefits in your business and in your life. Make it a discipline. Don't think so much about the rewards of content, which will come. But let me give you a couple of uh, examples, stories that might be inspiring to you. So, one of the most popular content creators, most respected ones, Seth Godin, has been blogging consistently since 2002. Think about that. 17 years. Now, what's even more remarkable is he did it for two years before he got any consistent engagement with his content, anybody who's consistently liking or sharing his stuff. Yeah, I'm sure he got occasional likes and shares here and there, but you can look back on his, his entire blog archives, which is what I did. I kind of did a quick study on it, and I noticed that for the first year's blog post, relatively few. Now, of course, now that he's so famous, people do go back to his original ones and probably liked and loved some of them, but... I did the study a couple years ago, and for, it took two years before his consistency started to pay off. And then, more than that, it took another six years. So it took eight years. Okay, it took eight years of consistent blogging before he got he really made it big time. I'm only in let's see, f uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm only in my sixth year of consistent content. And really, twenty mid-2015 was when I really got consistent with it. 2014 was still kind of sporadic. So, what about you? Have you been doing it consistently for two years? Probably not. And so I, and I urge you to commit to this consistency of content as a discipline, worthwhile in itself, if you're going to just be disciplined about anything, right? You could be disciplined about practicing a musical instrument. Wonderful. You could be disciplined about exercise. That's important. But when it comes to your business, what are you going to be disciplined about? Let it be content. Because the content has so many other benefits. Before you start to make an impact and start to get clients and start to make money from content, before that, all that happens, you're going to have the chance in creating content to explore your ideas and to create ideas, to create all the combinations of ideas that you have read in your lifetime and you've studied, you've watched, you've thought about, okay? And also practicing being public with yourself, but without, even without anybody watching, just practicing being public either in video or in writing, just practicing the confidence of that is so important and so beneficial in other ways. And then, then may you be blessed. One day, you know, one year, you'll start to make impact and you'll start to get clients, make money from your content. If you learn how to do content distribution, like with Facebook ads, this, these things will happen sooner. Your impact will happen a lot sooner. But whether or not you do that, make it a discipline to create and publish content. You will not regret it. It will create so many other benefits for you, Okay. You're, you're, you're going to be creating a body of work as well. So uh, the blog post that I'm going to be posting today, uh, what is it, June June 3rd? Is it June 4th? I can't, get, can't even get the date straight. Um, June 4th, I think it is, will be about the rhythm of con content creation. And you can go to my blog for that, and I'll share with you what my rhythm is. But more importantly, I'll give you some guidance on how you might want to create your rhythm. So go for it. Commit to the consistency of content creation and publishing, and everything else will tend to follow. Blessings.